Happy 2022. I'm so glad to see you. I'm Ryan and I have been hacking things my whole life. I really love 3D printing, the power that it can create, what it can do for you, and I probably will be 3D printing for the rest of my life. I wanted to thank you for your involvement of last year's video. A lot of people really liked that video. Thank you for your support, but some people didn't like the video. And I will address that during this video, and then I will talk about it at the end too. So let's get started with the countdown of 50 things to print in 2022 in 10 minutes. All of these products have really good reviews and very good sales. I've done all that research for you. So Legos are a really big business, a multi-dollar business, and why not grab onto that? This is a Lego sizer. Just Google on all the things that you can make around Legos. Bottle openers can be customized. This is a really simple one that you can just print flat, do colors, or add names. So people have a business and they want to sport their name and put their business card. You can customize that with the name of their business or the name of the artist. So it's really important to understand you can customize things. So uh, making your own t-shirts at home, this is a cricket or a cry cut caddy. You can make these and customize those. They simply don't exist. This is a soap dispenser. You can put someone's name on it. You can customize it. You can add a brand, but these are very, very readily used. Most people are using soaps. Custom signs are huge. You can make bathroom signs, do not disturb signs, open and close signs. Whatever you are, you can just extrude them and just add the colors on top or use a dual extruder. So custom signs are huge. This is a lid for a slider lid for a regular highly used cup. You can just put people's name on them. You can sell a variety of names and do custom orders. This is a temperature meter that you would put on. It's been painted silver and then it's been sanded down so that the black shows. Christmas ornaments uh, or any types of ornaments are easily printable. These aren't the highest selling item, but they certainly are popular. This is a game control. These are all over the place. Please respect people's designs. You would have to make your own, but this is something with everything changing. There's not a really big market for the PlayStation one. Keys, this is locking key. I'm really enjoying that show. These would sell for like 10 to $20 because they're all sold out in Etsy. This is something to hold your page open without putting a lot of effort. This is something that you could give for a gift or you can sell, customize it. You can actually laser cut this or you can 3D print it and you can do a variety of colors. This sells on Etsy, I've checked for sure on that and it's gotten a, little, a lot of good reviews. Custom dice for games, whether or not you make up your own game or whether or not you have to replace one. You can print those to either do resin printing or actually do clear. This is a funny little possum earring. This sells for a lot of money, but it was sold out on Etsy. And I thought, what an opportunity for people to do in 3D printing and paint it. This is a nifty pill dispenser. It's an Oreo cookie that you can actually put Advil in or your favorite drugs. Okay, this is a high decibel whistle. This is for using things for security. You could give this, I have a couple daughters, I could give this to them and you could just scream in addition to putting mace in their face. Measuring tools like this measuring spoon are really huge and sometimes you don't have the exact amount that you want so you could find niches with that. This is not the most attractive battery dispenser, but battery dispensers are not utilized right now, especially rechargeable batteries. I don't think anyone's looked at that market right now and figured out how do rechargeable batteries work, how can they be stored, and how can you know them? But that is something that someone is gonna look for. A lot of people make jewelry with quarters and dimes. This is a punch uh, that holds the basic size quarters and dimes and you can punch it through. It's a simple thing of just using a Boolean operation and fusing to create and you can list that on your Etsy shop. This is a really cool bottle opener. I thought that it was really cool how you used a penny for that and you can put any name and customize that. That would sell like for $10 on Etsy. It definitely has reviews and high sales. Coasters, my last name is DeWitt. You can print coasters really easily. They print really fast and they're really neat and they breathe. Laptop stands are incredible because 
everyone is breaking their neck with technology right now and this gives people the ability to do it and just as a simple extrusion where you print it flat tool holders this is not a great picture but i would say that ha designing stuff to put custom tools like ryobi milwaukee all these great tools out there is important bottle openers this is a magnetic bottle opener and it just holds the the um the, the bottle perfectly when it's released tool caddies there's lots of different tool caddies out there but you can customize this wherever you want you put it on so-and-so's workshop and it's going to sell really well okay this is the uh, a toilet paper design that i saw you'd have to make your own but this toilet paper design is really cool because you can play tic-tac-toe in the bathroom speaking of toilet paper <clears throat> There, this is a really nifty design that I saw that you can lift it open and you can remove the paper. Bracelets, jewelry are really important um, to people and they're really great gifts. This is a hexagonal or a, 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 a like a geometric one. Cup holders are really important for office situations. You could probably come up with a really unique way to sell um, or make a cup holder that protects the cup so no one else touches them so i thought that would be like you could market that as something that was safe you know sort of COVID friendly dog biscuit uh, cookie cutters are really um important because important to understand that market because you can make any shape that you want out of a cookie cutter and you can help other people run stores this is a simple jewelry travel jewelry box it's not i don't really like printing in red but you can put your name there i just thought that was a cool idea again this is a another thing for makeup and i did another one last year and this has a trash can below so not only can you do your makeup with the caddy above it but you could throw things away this is a, a, a carrier for your favorite drink um, it's just kind of really cool and modern looking. I thought that was a really neat design. Okay, a lot of cords are getting messed up. It must be a billion dollar market, the cord industry. These not only protect your cords, but they have your name on them. This is a webcam cover. It just protects your uh, privacy as you're uh, surfing the internet. It's something that you can add a lot to the left or the right. You just gotta make them super thin. This is a door hanger. It's actually laser cut, but you can 3D print a door hanger and say keep out or just a message or whatever you want. This is a soldering station that helps you wire two wires together. I don't think this was designed perfectly yet. I think you can add other things. Guitar picks can be completely customized. And I think you would be impressed to see your buddy playing a guitar of a guitar pick that you made necklaces are really cool and i think it's really simple how you can draw a 2d shape and you can extrude it in fusion and get a really cool necklace or a piece of jewelry for acrylic this planter i love planters and what they can do with it but i like the grouping kind of looks like a castle but i thought succulents are a great gift but i think this would sell this is a private shelf all right, a little small, a little intricate and frou-frou for me, but I liked it because not only is it shelf, but you can hide your cashola. This is an adjustable wrench. I thought this would be good for bikers. Um, it's something that you could find a market that did not exist and then go into fusion and make something that fits perfectly. All right, razor holders. I don't have a razor holder. I want one. I just want the right one. Whoa, I, and so you could make hooks and for hooks for robes too. This is a peeler for oranges, and this is something that will help you peel your orange or eat your orange or whatever else it is, but it's a simple little device that doesn't exist in Harris Teeter that you can make for yourself. So this is a guitar holder. This guitar holder is something that um, I think it would be very, very common for people to buy. This is a uh, headphone holder. You can put, go ahead and do a uh, text on a rail and then put your extrude that to get your headphone holder tiny little iPhone holder But it's really really effective and really really nice. You can go it from there And this is a bag holder. Wow I carry like 20 bags when I leave the grocery This would be great to put into your recyclable bags so that you can don't have to fumble around and of course cables are all over the place and cable management is huge everyone needs something to stay sane these days 
And then this is something neat. I thought you could use this for your drill or anything else. This is a Dremel holder, but you could also make a holder for your drill or any tool that's in your shop. So that, that wraps up all 50 of them. Now I wanna talk about last year's video and address some of the comments that were in last year's video. So a lot of people didn't like it. They were suggesting that I was in, or I was implying, or I never oped, owned up to the fact that I told someone to go on Thingverse and download a file. And I think however you look at that video, you may find that. And I'm gonna apologize because my intention was that you would look or be inspired by a file and you would make it in Fusion yourself. Anyways, that's it. Whatever you do, make something that connects someone. Peace and love, guys. Take care.